Welcome back, this is John Locke. And today, I just wanna take a few minutes to encourage you, if you have seen traffic drop on your site over the last six months, year, three months, whatever it is, I encourage you to look at things at a page-by-page -page basis. And the reason why is because most of the time people are, are trying to find a quick um, solution to this and they think that it might be a site-wide thing that's going on. Most of the time it's a page-by-page -page basis. And one thing that you should do is go into Google Analytics and look at the list of all the pages, the traffic by page. And what I want you to do is look at a significantly long enough time period, whether it's three months, six months, a year, whatever you decide, and look at the that compare that to the equivalent time period before and see which pages have dropped. Because what you're gonna find in most cases is that a handful of pages have probably dropped in traffic and that's what's amounting to your overall site traffic dropping. There might be many pages where the traffic is about the same, maybe it dropped a little bit, maybe it went up a little bit. There might be other pages that have had an increase but the pages on your site that account for most of the traffic may have gone down. And there may be reasons for that. And maybe that nobody's looking for that particular thing anymore. That's not common. Um, but sometimes, and most of the time, what you're looking at is there are pages that are now better than yours or users, the people who search in Google and they're looking for a solution or an answer or a way to an accomplish and a goal, they find that there's better pages. Now Google is using real user signals a lot of the time. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is look not only at the content, but also the user experience of these pages. That might be a thing that is overall on your site, but look at the content of what's ranking above you when you identify which pages have actually dropped on your site if indeed you're, you're seeing that only some pages have dropped and some are pretty much the same, there might be a little up or down, but it's the handful of pages that have dropped that are causing this big uh, traffic drop off. Now, the next thing that you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna look with a very discerning eye and objectively at your site in each of these pages, look at what is ranking above you or what's ranking right around you if you're not number one for all of these uh, search terms. And what you're looking for is differences in the pages that seem to rank above you or right around you and your page. And what you're looking for is ways that you can improve your individual pages. And most of the time you're gonna wanna add different things to the content because there might be things that are common in the content of those pages that people are actually trying to find or Google's machine learning has identified these characteristics of this page, maybe some things that are mentioned there, maybe some things that people can do there. But these things uh, have been identified as a measure of quality and the machine learning has seen that when they get the user signals, if these things are present, if they talk about these things or if these elements are present or if people can accomplish a certain goal or find out a certain information, then these are more likely to rank higher because people are more satisfied with those pages according to the user signals. So that's a very important thing to understand. You might have an objectively or a subjectively good page, but there might be other people doing it better. And the other thing that you can do is maybe tighten up the design a little bit, make sure that everything looks really sharp on that page, make sure that you're presenting the information uh, in a way that's very pleasing to your site visitors. So that's what I just wanna focus on. And again, one way that you can do it is just look at the overall traffic. That's the simplest way, just go into Google Analytics, look at all pages, and then just look at the traffic. But if you really wanna do it the right way, you're gonna wanna go to uh, acquisition, all pages, source and medium and you're gonna to wanna to tap on the one that says Google Organic. It'll be a list of all your sources of traffic under acquisition and source medium. So you're gonna to wanna to tap on Google Organic. Now there's going to be a little 
drop down menu uh, right above that list uh, where it says here's the overall traffic for Google and it just shows the number and it just says here's what you got beforehand and you know here's what was in the previous period but that secondary dimension that you can filter by is by landing page that's what you're gonna to want to type in there is by landing page and then you can look and see exactly where you gained or lost or stayed the same in organic Google traffic for each of these pages now the reason why you want to do this is to get the most accurate view because sometimes people share things on Facebook you might have gotten traffic up or down and it might have been because of a Facebook campaign or Instagram campaign or you know paid ads or whatever so that's why I encourage you to do it this way because you get the most accurate uh, sense of what's going on so uh, again look at these individual pages in Google Analytics see what went up what went down it's probably not your site as a whole it's probably the pages that were accounting for most of your traffic and these may change over time as well you might see uh, pages that dip down and you might see new pages go up but it's very important to look at things at a page by page basis SEO does take a little bit of work Anyway, my name is John Locke. My business is Lockdown Design and SEO. I'm here about every other day making videos on SEO. I encourage you to subscribe. I'll be putting out another video in another couple days. We're almost at 1,000 subscribers, so I'd love to see you subscribe. That's all I have for now. Until next time, peace.